Hi, it's Friday, and I want to give away some free stuff. And today, that is free titles for DaVinci Resolve. I've put together a pack of 16 titles for DaVinci Resolve that replicate some of the iconic styles you saw in WordArt. If anyone out there doesn't know, WordArt was this tool inside Word for a long time. I, I think it might still be in there, maybe just PowerPoint. I don't know, I haven't used Word in a long time. But for years and years and years, if you were making a flyer for a pool party or a birthday party, there were lots of parties you used word art. And today I'm bringing a lot of that nostalgia and classic look to DaVinci Resolve. If you follow the link in the description, you will get to a download page uh, for this effect, SSC Resolve Art. You can download this DRFX and if you double click it, it will uh, give you this pop-up in Resolve. Whether you want to install, you can click install. It might require you to restart. In this case, it does for me, so I'm just gonna restart Resolve. I'm back up and running inside my effects library. I come to title, Sterling Supply Company. We have all of these Resolve art styles and they all have this uh, handy little preview for you. First, I'm actually gonna create a, a generator, uh, drag that out, make that white, just so you can see all of these different styles we're working with. Back in Sterling Supply Company, you have all of these options and you can just drag them onto your timeline and get these are really classic to some iconic looks. Select them and in your inspector, you have a few custom controls so you can change this to be whatever or something impactful like subscribe. You do have just a small handful of controls here, but changing things like the font, the scale and a basic position. In this menu, you have titles, but you can always jump back over to settings when you have all your basic transform effects as well. And just like all of my presets, if I come to this title, you have the name of that title and these custom controls, but you also have this button over in the corner. And if I click that, it will load up the title in the fusion page. And you can see the group that is that title opened up and you see it is just this one text layer. Uh, but we are achieving this effect through using shading elements. I've talked about shading elements before. They're very powerful and they're used all over the place in this pack. And that can be useful, but also useful for some other of these titles. This one has this really classic like long shadow look and that is not done using shading elements. If I open that in Fusion, you see that that is actually made using this directional blur that we then tie into a bitmap, crank it down, use that as a mask on this other shape merge back together. Now you have this really awesome like hard shadow coming over. And if you jump into fusion, you can always come to directional blur, and crank up that length. Awesome. There are a number of cool little tips and tricks in here for anyone that wants to dive more into depth into fusion, or you can just use these as is drag them onto your edit page timeline, change up the text, and you're dealing with some iconic looks. Again, link in the description, free download. These are hosted as like a pay what you want sort of deal. And I actually developed a good amount of these on my last live stream, my live stream occasionally. So subscribe and turn on notifications if you don't want to miss any of those. Uh, live streams are really chill here, um, but informative, always an open resolve Q&A. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.